happened to you? Nothing. School bullying is one of the biggest problems for kids at school. We interviewed our classmates and find out that up to 40% of children experience bullying. Меня называют человеком рыбкой. Кто-то это сказал, но потом прицепилась к моему имени и теперь меня называют балуком. Говорили то, что я странная, тупая, но я сама до сих пор не могу догадаться, почему они меня так называли. В прошлой школе меня все унижали, брали мою форму, кидали и играли ею. There are several types of bullying. The most common one physical, verbal and emotional. A bullying leads to less class productivity because of bullies. Victims can lose their self-esteem and feel really depressed. However, for victims, it's not easy to tell others about being bullied. What if our children could share their feelings and problems to someone who closer to them? Introducing Spikey, applications that helps adults to identify bullying. We want Spikey to become every child's friend, so they communicate with them openly. Spikey app should be installed on teachers, parents, child's mobile phone. The idea is to gather data from four different sources and by using AI to find out whether a child feels depressed after school and if answer is yes, Spikey gives signal to parents so they can talk to their child. Indeed, but to make conversation natural, Spikey collects information about our interests. After one or two icebreaker questions, Spikey asks child about how was her or his day at school. Similar question about child addressed to parent and teacher. Depending on the set of answers, artificial intelligence selects next question. After three questions, AI reports to parent probable bullying at school. There is one layer of filter is camera that we plan to install at school. So every day after school, the camera grabs the photos and using emotion detector technology, it analyzes child's mood. Spiky gives exposure level from high to low. This will help parents to understand was their child bullied or not. Я считаю, что тема буллинга очень актуальна на сегодняшний день, и было бы очень хорошо, если бы у детей в школах была возможность поделиться, рассказать, решить свою проблему. Дело в том, что Дети очень боятся осуждения, очень боятся критики и держат очень много проблем в себе. Это только страх. Но если бы было такое приложение, которое помогало бы детям конфиденциально, частным образом решать проблему, мне кажется, это было бы очень большим подспорьем в решении этой проблемы. We hope that this invention will help millions of children in Uzbekistan and in the world. And you can help children just by using our AI invention.